week of October 28th through November 3rd. I am using an undated planner. Um, this was, I think, the, a well-crafted life or something like that. And I am in my homebody mini happy planner. Um, so, I did not do a Halloween spread for my classic. Um, I mentioned in that video that I just needed something that was going to be functional and inspirational and that would really work for me because life has been so busy. But I really wanted to do a Halloween spread. So, the stickers that I'm using for this week are the old teacher seasonal book and then the original seasonal and original seasonal mini as well as this holiday tiny sticker pad. So I have my stickers all picked out right here. Um, most of these are from the seasonal sticker books, um, the like original ones, and then the ones at the bottom here are from the teacher one, and then these two are from ho the holiday. So I don't totally know what I'm going to do. Um, I know I want to use these, so I think I might just use them in the corner down here to cover up this part that says word of the week because I don't really use that. Um, so I'm just going to line this at the bottom. And then there's this one that says boo spooky eek. And I'm going to kind of cover that just a little bit and layer it like that because I don't typically, this is my on the go planner. So I use this for all of my errands and like appointments and stuff. And we don't typically do a lot of errands on Sunday. That's kind of our relax day. Um, so it's okay for me to cover up that part. And then I have this um, full box that has a little spider. And I think I'm gonna put that one on Monday. And there's that one, and then I have this other one, which is like some fall colors. And I think I'm going to do that on Saturday, because that's typically when we do most of our errands um, and getting most of the stuff done. So, and then I have these other like kind of half boxes, I guess you could call them. And I'm going to layer some stickers on here. So Halloween is Thursday. So I'm going to kind of put this up here like that. And then I have this trick or treat here. Because Thursday is Halloween. And then this gold foil Halloween sticker from the teacher seasonal book. And I'm going to put that there. Okay. So now I have this one other box, and I don't want to layer two on top of each other, but I also have a lot already on that page. So I might just cut this in half, or in a, at a diagonal, at a, what is it? What did I just say? I don't even know. At a diagonal. That's what, that's what it's called. Um, and then I'm going to... Put it here. Covers up the F a little bit, but that's okay. And then maybe here. Okay, I like that so far. Um, and now I just have a bunch of little like decorative stickers. I have this spider thing, spider web, that I'm gonna put like up in this corner, but I need to wipe out that part. Um, this line up here. So, I haven't done this technique in a long time because it wasn't really working for me. Um, for some reason, like, I don't, just don't know if I don't have the right pen 
or what's going on, but I'm gonna try this one. Okay, that's better. This one is a lot more white. It's a lot more opaque. Okay, so I'm just gonna let that dry and then I'll work on this page. Um, I'm not a really big into Halloween, um, just cause like I don't have kids, so, and I'm also too old to like dress up and I don't really party or anything, so like, I don't know, I'm not really into it, but I do have a niece and nephew who are little, and so I, I might end up going trick-or-treating with them, depending what, on what they do, and... Yeah, so, we'll see. Okay, so I have these, like, little bat things. And I don't really know what I'm going to use them for. I think I'm just going to kind of spread them out. But I have, there's, like, some paper ones, and then there's some clear ones. And I don't really like the paper ones, because you have the, like, outline. But, oh well, I'll make it work. And then I have these little ghosts. That are kind of cute. And I think I might just like layer on Thursday maybe. Like that. And then these like poisons. Maybe I'll just put it here. Um, and then there's a sticker that says boo. I think I'll put it on Friday. And I can cover that part up now that it's dry. Cut the edges so yeah what do you do you guys do for Halloween do you go to a party do you have kids and go trick-or-treating do you just stay home and pass out candy like let me know in the comments below what you guys do on Halloween because I'm, I'm always interested to see like what people other people do and then there's all these little candies and I'm gonna put a couple on Halloween because it's Halloween and I know I'm taking up a lot of space um, of writing. But I have these little candy corns that are really cute. I'm kind of using them as bullet points on a couple of these days for things I need to do. Um, and then these little potion bottles. And then I have a couple, I have one more spider, maybe I'll just do right there. And then this bat, but it's a paper bat, so maybe I'll just go like that. Okay, so that is all I'm doing. I did take a lot of room on Thursday, um, but that's okay. I don't do a lot Thursdays anyway because we have our um, group. So, it'll work. It'll work for me. But yeah, I, I think it's cute. There's kind of a lot going on. Um, I probably used more stickers than I needed to. But I think it's cute and I'm glad that I got to use these stickers that I was hoarding and all the fall Halloween stickers that I've had for ever. So I'm glad I got to finally use them. Um, the only thing I need to do is date them. And I don't have any like date stickers or anything, so I'm just going to write them in. So the Monday, 28th, and then Friday is the 1st, 2nd, and 3rd. Okay, so yeah, that's all I'm doing. This is a pretty quick video since I already have my stickers picked out. Um, for my mini, I usually just kind of wing it, but since I had, like, a plan of doing Halloween, um, I pre-picked my stickers just to save some time. But, I hope you enjoyed this video. I would love to hear in the comment section below what you thought of this video. Also, what are you doing for Halloween? Um, what, do you have any, like, traditions and stuff with your family and that kind of stuff? So, let me know in the comment section below, and I can't wait to see you guys next time. Okay, bye!